Hey family, how you doing? It's me, Beacon, and uh, just wanted to get on here because there is just so much going on at this time. And, um, you know, we are going into a season uh, that forces us to kind of go internal, I guess, depending on where we are. But uh, a lot of us are going into a season that forces us. It's telling us it's time to go inside and work. And that is so amazing to have that physical manifestation of that, that spiritual message, uh, you know, so vivid and clear. Um, and this is a really good time to tap into those energies and uh, work on your gifts and you know, uh, practice your, your meditation and your connection with your higher self. Uh, there's so much to do in this season and, uh, <laughs> almost like there's not enough time to get all the things done that you want to get done. But in due time, I suppose, I guess there's no rush, even though we're feeling that kind of push, there's really no rush in our spiritual development. Where we are is where we're supposed to be. And, um, you can't really force your growth. I mean, I guess to an, an extent you can. You can definitely do things to uh, raise your vibration and your frequency in order to uh, manifest what you want or do the things that you want to do. But anyway, um, I mentioned in, I believe it was my last video where I talked about, uh, you know, maintaining a balanced frequency as, as much as you can trying to avoid those peaks and valleys, or as Buddha called it, walking the middle way, or as Yeshua called it, the straight and narrow path. It's all the same thing. Um, but that is going to become an extremely important uh, uh, discipline for us. And so I really encourage you, and I'm doing this myself too, just really trying to uh, learn how and teach myself how to walk the middle way, or the straight and narrow path, or keep my uh, vibration as consistent as possible, avoiding those peaks and valleys, because that is where you're going to be in the right frame of mind and spirit to um, do what you want to do. Um, you know, um, uh, sharpen the gifts that you have or develop new ones or whatever. Um, when you're in that frame. And so that's why I feel like that message is extremely important. And I'm not the only one uh, speaking that message. You're hearing it kind of across the board of, you know, uh, YouTube mystics, <laughs> for lack of a better term. <laughs> um, uh, but anyway, um, yeah, that's why that that is being so strenuously pushed right now is because we're just trying to help not just ourselves, but everybody who's walking this path, um, raise themselves up to their highest potential, uh, at this time. Um, but also there is a possibility that this is going to be my last video because, uh, from what I understand, there's some pretty serious stuff going on with YouTube. I have gotten the messages and, and, and everything telling me to, you know, put my videos as to whether they're child friendly or not or whatever. Um, and they're really pushing me to monetize my channel. And I think they're doing that with a lot of people, but I'm not going to conform into their little system and so there's a good chance that you won't see me on here anymore but if you do want to keep in contact my email address uh, is cosmickiss1111 at gmail.com and who knows maybe they'll remove that as well if they decide that, that I'm a threat to their programming <laughs> um, but anyhow uh, which they probably will even though I have like a very 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 small subscriber base and it's only dropping but that's because the message that i share is extremely high vibrational and uh, there are a lot of people that um aren't ready for that type of information at, at this point uh, and i really feel like half the time i'm not even but it, i it, it it's given to me anyway um but anyway um yes i do also, another thing too, if you are interested in having me do like a rune reading or some uh, runic magic I, uh, for 
anything that you need, and that would obviously, being rune magic, would come with a type of talisman as well. So if you're interested in that type of service, if you want me to create a magical rune for you for your specific um, direction, whatever you want, then you, you can contact me at that same email address, cosmickiss1111 at gmail.com. Um, but I, I would love to help you in that aspect as well. So contact me if you're interested in that service. And uh, yeah, I can do divination with it as well if you're interested in divination or if you would rather prefer a magical talisman that you can keep with you and within your arc field at all times and benefit from. Um, I can do that as well. So anyway, um, gosh, I hope I'm getting the message, all the stuff that I want to get across for my last video, <laughs> uh, potentially my last video. Not necessarily. Um, anything else that I want to relay to you guys? I guess just ask any questions in the comments uh, section if you if you want anything specifically answered and according to my perspective as well. Because you got to keep in mind, all of us are, ch are a type of channel and all of us are receiving. Uh, our information and then we have this brain which is actually a filter um, that projects it as our own per personal biases because we are support there's I mean we're all different for a reason the the source is experiencing itself from every angle every point of view every perspective in the entire universe and so no one is going to uh, no two it's like snowflakes no two people are going to be the same uh, they're each going to have their own spiritual blueprint slash or fingerprint or whatever you want to call it you know that individuality of that per particular perspective so um let's see here yeah <laughs> um just trying to think of anything else that i could give you yeah um, just just ask it in the comments and we'll try to work it out if you're interested in information uh, or you know some runic magic or divination or just want to talk or have and have a conversation that's entirely welcome as well so I love you guys and I'm super excited for the incoming energies as I'm sure you guys are all aware of that and just as excited as I am so Anyway, keep the vibration high in terms of uh, positivity and it'll help elevate the, the consciousness for the human collective as you do that. And that's really, really important whether you do, you know, do that through meditation or, you know, any type of ritual work or magical work or whatever. Just continue raising the human collective vibration as you're currently doing, most likely. Um, love you guys. And hopefully we'll talk to you soon and have a great week.